Okay, so how's everybody doing? I'm going to do whatever spirit leads me to do. What kind of reading? I don't know. I am thinking of connecting with Gaia, nature. So let's use the Gaia deck. Let's show this picture. It's beautiful Mother Earth. Where's my camera? There we go. Mother Earth. I love that card. Okay. What messages? We've got rainbows, blessings here. Vision quest. Karma, DNA, one, give me one for karma, okay, right, so it's going, it's taking great strength, I feel, to clearing, clearing out karma here, okay, pretty, I'm just going to explain it very simply here. Let's get one for vision quest. What do I mean? Vision quest for? Oh, it's for a new beginning. For a new beginning. Let's see. There we go. Vision quest. Okay. For a new beginning. Dawn. Blessings. What's this rainbow blessings? Oh, wow. Solitude Island. This, so this tells me. You are your greatest ally, enemy, however you want to see. You are your greatest of everything, meaning the blessings come from spending time with self, getting to know yourself. That is the blessing. Let's get a direction. For strength in DNA, karma, releasing karma, spark. Yeah, so this is moving quickly, I feel. It's the spark card. This is like climbing the mountain. Big strides, big steps in evolution. And it started with this spark here. So something is sparking and it's going fast. It's transformed by love. Let's get one for new beginning and desert. Heal the ouchies. Okay, so what do you do on a vision quest or any type of any type of quest? Uh, the seeker, like searching within, healing, healing that for this new beginning. So it takes some tending to any wounds any wounds whether that be physical mental okay so what is this rainbow blessings island solitude commitment Ooh. so those of you I feel like yes it's like being in solitude for so long worked on yourself you're receiving blessing of higher level of commitment love this could also be friendship new um, partners as far as like um, in work, but I really feel with the blessings, you guys are going to be blessed with commitment there. So that's really beautiful. <clears throat> and then let's get an animal for each one. So this is different. I'm just trying different views. Okay. The beaver fell on the ground. <laughs> Hard work. Hard, you know, I don't even want to say hard work, but like determination perseverance in your self growth okay so give me one for spark mountain and DNA karma okay we got the moth it's like what's that saying the the moth to the flame the spark the flame moth and spark with dolphin playfulness so 
and seeing from a higher perspective, the dolphin is very connected telepathically. So the dolphin energy is helping you right now. Okay, so let's get one for this. Heal the Ouch, Dawn and Vision Quest. Is New Beginning, an animal card. Cobra, interesting. I, the way I'm reading this, just by itself, not looking at the, the, the book. Vigilance, uh, con consciousness, like very, see he looks so focused and you know it's like right before they strike, the very focus. So very focused on this vision here, okay? This vision of this new beginning. Very focused on healing, what needs to be healed. for this new beginning. Okay, let's get an animal for this for Rainbow Island Commitment. Yeah. Okay. Beautiful. Oh my goodness. I got these two as well. I will show them. They came out. The buffalo and the horse. Very beautiful. The one that popped out is the peacock. Oh my gosh. I love it. Beautiful. Higher dimensional consciousness. Knowing your true spirituality. Commitment with the blessings. And it's because of all of the inner work that you've done on yourself with the solitude in that island. It will be blessed. It's a big blessing. So that's the peacock there. So... Okay, it's just a little mini reading. I'm experimenting with different things and stuff. All right, you guys. Take care. Bye.